Hi there, thanks for stopping by. My name is Rose Grunewald. I'm an independent demonstrator with Stampin' Up! and I'm coming at you today from my Stampin' Studio here in New Holstein, Wisconsin. Today I am featuring this stunning card. I made this card along with a couple others in my recent virtual stamp class on my Facebook page, Country Cards by Rose. And we made three cards that you could use to send to the special men in your life. So the video tutorial for this card is a clip taken from that event. I think that you'll really enjoy it and have a lot of fun. All right, let's get stamping. Cards. On to our... Ta-da! Next. Oops. What do you think? Very simple. We are using the Everything is a Stamp Set. I love this one because you can use so, 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 so many greetings. Uh, I'm using the Deer that says Seasons. And I've got a couple letters on this card. So I have a hard base out of Cinnamon Cedar. Love, love, love this. Letter. Yeah, Julie, it's going to break up the whole video, unfortunately. Uh, I'm just having internet issues here, so um, hopefully you guys are still based. Uh, I'm so sorry. I apologize. Um, I think the internet people are going to get in tomorrow. Okay, and uh, a layer early espresso. This piece is five and a quarter by four, and then a cinnamon cider layer that is five, three, and three quarters, and these are all going to go on together like this. My woodland embossing folder here, and um, bring in a shot and do some embossing. I do that. I'm going to cut out my circle that we're going to use. So I'm using the layering circles. We've got two sizes that go together that. And my cinnamon cider piece. And larger circle, we're gonna wait a little bit to cut out. So the side map. Who says God love technology? Oh my gosh, right? And you know where I live, Sue. You know I don't have a lot of interaction out here in the boondocks. So it is so frustrating because I don't have a lot of options. I'm kind of at the mercy of people. It's frustrating. Inland embossing folder. I'm going to try and line this up here. Ooh, I almost did. Like so. All right. And then, oops. I missed a lick my sandwich. Okay, running that through our embossing our uh, embossing machine. And then we've got this beautiful, beautiful popped up embossed layer that I absolutely love. And we are gonna go back to our embossing machine. Oh my gosh, so much big shot using this card, guys, right? What we're going to do is we are going to cut, Julie, you're in the same situation where you're like at mercy of these darn technology companies. I want to cut using a bigger circle, um, a circle a little bit to the top here. And that looks centered to me. So, third, if you will, um, but in the center of the curve. We're done with our embossing machine for now, our cutting machine, die cutting. All right. Um, what we need to do now is add here our, our cinnamon cider layer, our early espresso. And because this is using liquid glue to make sure I get a good bond here and that it does not lift up and these pieces come apart. You know, that's the good thing. If you have to kids to bed, uh, that I love about Facebook Live here. If you have to kids to bed or 
if I'm having technology issues like I am tonight, you can always go back and watch the replay. Works great. I've got the layer glued down to my next layer, and I'm not going to forget this this time. I'm going to wrap some of my braided linen trim. I love this stuff. And I mean, it bows your eye because it's just a little bit sticky. And I like that one. I'm tying a bow. Ooh. I'm going to wrap this around layer. I'm going to tie it in a bow over here on the side. And I wanted it a little backwards from my, there we go. That's what I wanted to do. Actually, what? that isn't what I want. It's upside down so that my bow goes the right way. And then you just adjust your ends. They're the size that you want. You can even turn this bow a little bit if you want to. I'm going to wait until I have my other layer on. Yes, Luann, this wood tree in the background is my favorite. By far, my favorite embossing tree. Um, it's actually been my favorite ever since I first became a demeter and never changed. It's been my favorite the whole time. I'm using a little espresso ink here, and we're stamping our seeds readings in the sample. I don't always do so good once it's dyed. I didn't do too bad there. Um, and then we're going to pop up the metals. I've got um, braided linen trim going through there, so I'll use one on the top and I'll leave some room for that here. And then I'm just going to center the into a circle, like so, not straight. Oh my gosh, there. Like that. And now that I know everything's lined up really good, I'm gonna trim the ends of my bow. And now we're ready to enter our card front layer, card base. Do you see how easy this is to just use beautiful dimensionals? I hate using the borders, you guys. Oh my gosh, the little nuts are make us happy, right? Oh, so funny. So funny, such a little thing that my goats are. All right. So this on our card base, like so, probably try that again, thanks a lot, <laughs> there, this looks like it's going to be better, there we go, there we have it, done, this is the simplest card, and it is so, absolutely love it, you've got Thank you so much for watching my video tutorial. I hope that you found it helpful, that you got some creative inspiration and some great tips and tricks to make your crafting easier. Now, if you don't have a Stampin' Up! demonstrator, I would love to earn your business. You can shop my online store. There's a link to do that at uh, countrycardsbyrose.blogspot.com. And when you place your order, I would love if you use my November 2020 host code VBYQBQJN if your order is under $150. If your order is over $150, you're going to want to skip that code because you'll qualify for some Stampin' Up! rewards. And I want to make sure that you are getting the rewards for free product. Better yet, if your order is over $150, you really should be signing up to be a discount shopper. You'll get 20% off your order and you'll get free shipping on your order and then 20% off of your future orders as long as you remain an active demonstrator. If that's something that you're interested in, um, pop me an email at countrycardsbyrose.gmail.com. 
All right, thanks again for stopping by, and I know that I will be stamping with you soon. Have a great day.